we get a lot of potential customers asking us, should I build a Memberium Learn Dash site? And they ask it as if Memberium Learn Dash was one product. Can I build a Learn Dash, a, a Memberium Learn Dash site? Should I build a Memberium Learn Dash site? Again, they they look at Memberium Learn Dash as, as if it was one and the same. Um, it, they're a really good combination. They work really well together. They complement each other with very different functions, but they are two distinct things. You know, they go well, like I said, like wine and cheese, and I'm a big wine and cheese lover. So let me go over exactly what these two tools use. If you're in the WordPress space or if you're considering building an online course in the WordPress space, these are two great tools to consider. But I think you really ought to understand what the two do, why they're different, especially if you're comparing it to other platforms that you might be considering. So first of all, LearnDash is what I consider a best in breed LMS. It's a learning management system. So it allows you to build courses. Courses are made up of lessons. So think of lessons like chapters in a book and then topics are sub lessons. So you can split up your courses into lessons. And if your course is really big, you can split each lesson up into topics and, and that way you organize your, co your content really well. Now you can rename courses to modules. You can rename lessons to chapters. You can rename topics to sub chapters. It's really up to you. They give you a lot of flexibility. Um, LearnDash gives you the ability to let people click around a course and, you know, move ahead, check out content that's and you know, way up forward. It can also allow you to be very strict. Like let's say you're teaching something like language or you're teaching something like math or programming. You can use it to keep people, I don't know that, you can use it to keep people from going ahead until they've mastered the previous topics. It provides you with the ability to, to create all sorts of courses, of course quizzes, so that you can test whether people have absorbed the material, understand it well enough. And that's really a useful tactic when you have people that are learning on the run, on the go, I call it the distracted learner. But you can also use quizzes to check out if people have really understood the content and use it as part of a certification. I mean, uh, a while back we built a, um, a course that could be used by pharmacists to get their CPE or their, their credits to uh, keep their licenses current. And there were some very strict requirements and they had to pass a pretty extensive quiz and pass it with more than 80 or 85% in order to get you know, the certification. And LearnDash provides very nice certificates that you can you know, give people so that they can frame it with all the information they need to submit to whatever the governing bodies are so that they can get the credits that they like. So that's what LearnDash does. Now, Memberium is very different. Memberium is a membership tool. So it allows you to give people access and give access to people with different levels. So you can create a website that gives people a free, uh, a silver and a gold plan where the free lets them taste some sample content to get them um some visibility into the kind of things that you produce with the ability to upsell them into silver with more content and gold with even more content. The, the way that Memberium works is it can it integrates very well with LearnDash by allowing you to enroll people into a course based on if they've purchased a membership level, uh, you can give them access to a whole collection of courses. Uh, and then one thing in particular that you can do is you can either keep people from seeing the course at all because they haven't purchased it or, or requested access to it, or you can allow them to see it, but only see the outline for it, sample a couple of teaser lessons at the beginning, and then stop them dead at, let's say, lesson three, saying, hey, this is membership-only content, and give them a nice little buy button or a link that takes them to a sales page that explains how they can get access to it, and it can get very, very elaborate. Now, Memberium does its job by connecting WordPress up with a CRM. Uh, it supports both Keep, which used to be called Infusionsoft, or ActiveCampaign. 
So this really gives you a lot of power because you can make a purchase, assign tags in your CRM, and then send welcome messages out from the CRM itself. That gives them their login credentials. Uh, and at that point, now sky's the limit. You can send people reminders to log in. Uh, if you notice that people are running through the program very slowly, you can kind of send them a, hey, you know, in order to be successful, you really got to log in once or twice a week. You can even use automation to signal to one of your sales team members or a customer service person to email them or call them. Um, I mean, there's really a lot of features that you can use once you've connected a Learn Dash site with Membarian to a CRM to, to do just so many things. So when you talk about a Membarian Learn Dash site, which seems like one thing, you're really talking about two things. But once you combine what a CRM membership program like Membarium and Learn Dash can do together, uh, you just have so many options. It's great for just getting started. And it, you really have a platform that allows you to grow offering everything that WordPress, Learn Dash, and Keep or your active campaign CRM can, can do for your, uh, your online course, for your business, and the kind of things you're trying to accomplish.